really does display between two um, objects the nearest distance. So if I select this object, this wall here, and here I've got the sofa, it finds the nearest distance between those and it displays it there. Now I can even, I can, that's great for viewing, so as just a utility tool, that's great, but I can click on that and I can change the value. So I can get an exact distance, it moves based on the object that I select, the first one that I select. So for example, if I come in here to the sink and I'll select this object right here, I'll select the sink, displays the nearest distance. If I change that value, it's going to keep the line where it is, it's going to move the sink. Okay, now you can select sub-objects as well. So if I select the side of the counter over here, I'm pressing the control key this time so that it finds th that specific sub-entity, and then I'll select the sink. Again, displays the distance, and I can enter a value, that sink shifts over. So this would take you multiple steps doing this without nearest, this nearest distance tool.